how to use route master package in your flutter app to easily navigate between screens we can use this package by adding this in our pubspec.yml file next in my app.dart file instead of normal material app we are going to use material app.router which is wrapped by exclude semantics to avoid bugs in flutter web for this router we have set two properties that is route information parser which is set to route master parser which initialize a parser that works in conjunction with route master delegate and router delegate which is set to route master delegate which contains all the routes for our app here we return a route map object that contains a map of all the possible routes in our app each with its own corresponding page this is a root route which displays the route master page this is a route that displays page 1 while this is a route that displays page 2 this is the nested route this means that navigation to this route will show the page 1 widget with the page 2 widget embedded within it tabs route maps the tabs path to a cupertino tab page widget with a tabbed page child the cupertino tab page widget has two tabs identified by the paths tab 1 and tab 2 respectively when the user selects one of the tabs the corresponding page is displayed do you want to learn flutter in a better and faster way then simply join our 12-week flutter training on heyflutter.com where you master all the flutter topics such as start ui design state management firebase clean architecture databases and so on by watching our structured courses that help you for each topic to go from a newbie until an expert level in flutter tabs 1 is the tab that displays page 1 as a child of tabs while tabs 2 is a tab that displays page 2 as a child of tabs this is a private route that displays a private page with a message specified by a query parameter if the user navigates to a route that is not defined in the map the on unknown route property of route map is called in this case we returns a not found page we create a file route master page dot dot which is a stateless widget called route master page that displays a scaffold with an app bar and a list view containing several elevated button widget the first button labeled replace page one will replace the current page with the route one the second button labeled push page one will push a new page on the top of the current page with the route one the third button labeled replace tabs will replace the current page with the tab page defined in the route map with the path tab the four button labeled push private page will push a private page on the top of the current page the query parameter is used to pass additional information to push or replace page the fifth button labeled unknown route will try to replace the current page with the route asdf which is not defined in the route map this will result in the on unknown route function being called this is our page one which is a stateless widget called page one that displays a scaffold with an app bar and a list view containing containing several elevated button widgets. The elevated button widgets are used to navigate to different routes using Route Master. Now let's see our page 2 which we have already created. Here you can see we have simply displayed the text page 2 wrapped in a list view widget. Next we move to a file named tabpage.dart which is a stateless widget named tapped page. Here we have simply returned a cupertino tab scaffold containing three properties that is controller which is set to cupertino tab page controller a tab builder which is set to cupertino tab page tab builder and a cupertino tab bar containing a list of two bottom navigation bar items here is the page named private page where we simply display the message that is passed through the query parameter now here you can see if i tap on replace page one it will replace the page one with the route master page and if i push the private page you can see we have displayed the message private page pushed from page one if i tap unknown route you can see the there is a message displayed not found page and if I tap replace tabs here you can see the tab page is displayed with two bottom navigation bar items 